Tonight we are talking about a piece of work we are presenting here at the SLD Living Meeting in San Francisco mm -hmm. uh, called Trial-Based Model uh, of Liver Transplantation and Liver-Related Deaths in Primary Beta Cholangitis. The goal of this research is to see whether we can um, validate new surrogate endpoint measure in a clinical trial in PBC to help the development of new drugs. In We um, plugged in the number of the biochemical uh, measurement of the um, POIS uh, trials of beticolic acid in PBC in our uh, UK PBC score, which is a continuous score including five um, clinical measurements. And we found out that a uh, patient receiving a beticolic acid um, at 12 months present a reduction of the long term risk of liver event, liver transplantation, liver related death. The uh, UKPP series score has been developed um, in order to assess the, um, the risk at specific time frame for individual patient of developing liver event, liver transplantation, liver related death in patient with PBC. We apply these um, risk scores to the, um, to the POIS population, which is a population of patient, 260 patient uh, mm, that uh, treated with the obedicolic acid. And what we found out with this um, piece of work is that patients taking uh, obeticolic acid, particularly those taking the 10 milligram fixed dose, had a reduction of the risk of developing liver events at 5, 10 and 15 years, which was quite remar remarkable comparing the, uh, the placebo group. Well, this might mean that uh, the obeticolic acid is an effective drug in a uh, subgroup of patients with PBC that do not respond to the uh, ursidioxycolic acid that has been the only uh, treatment available so far in uh, uh, PBC. There is an ongoing confirmatory trials in um, obeticolic acid in PBC and that will hopefully um, validate, be able to validate our um, methodology in applying the, these continuous scores in the uh, in a trial population.